So there was a bombshell report this week that Giselle Bunchen is expecting her first child with her boyfriend. And apparently it was even a bombshell to Tom Brady we exclusively reported at page six. I'm the page six editor Ian Moore here with senior reporter Mara Siegler. And uh, yeah, apparently this was also news to Tom, but he actually didn't find out when the report in People magazine came out. He found out a couple days, well, a few days earlier. I heard he found out last week. Okay, and you spoke to a source that is close with Tom, correct? Yes, I spoke with a source who's uh, close with Tom Brady and basically had heard that, you know, he only knew about this a few days ago. Now, according to reports, Giselle is five to six months along in her pregnancy. So, you know, she kind of kept it from him for a while, but then there were other reports like, TMZ had a report where a source I assume close to Giselle was sort of saying like, well, you know, she actually gave him a heads up like before it came out in the press, but you know, she was keeping this under wraps for a while. And I think there were also some details on, you know, wh what are their, what's their relationship like now, Tom Brady and Giselle? Right. I mean, I think it's not like, I mean, obviously they co-parent, they have two children together. He has a son from a previous relationship um, who Giselle is also close with. But apparently they're not exactly, you know, I mean, I think they're co-parenting, we'll put it that way, but I, I don't think it's exactly a cozy relationship and they're, you know. Also on the Giselle front though, you had reported that she's not gonna be marrying her boyfriend anytime soon, even though they're now expecting their first child together. Right, so it's, and I actually think you broke this story, Joaquin Valente. Who yeah, is Joaquin the ju Valente. Jiu-Jitsu, didn't you first break that they yes, were dating? Yes, I exclusively, well, it was weird because they were very close for a long time, right? Like right after her divorce from Tom Brady was announced, they were on vacation together. He was with her in Costa Rica. He is her martial arts instructor. He is their children's martial arts instructor. And Giselle, uh, or, you know, people in her camp kept saying, no, they're just friends. But they were doing all sorts of things that you do with your friends, like horseback riding on the beach, you know, and like stuff. But then we did exclusively report that they were an item, they were actually together, but but sources close to Giselle say, you know, it was a friendship and it sort of blossomed into a romance and now it's blossomed into more than that because they're gonna be parents together. Yes, and so she, you know, divorced Tom Brady, I think it was two years ago now. So what my sources are telling me is she's really like not in a rush to marry, um, Joaquim anytime soon. Also, there is a difference between their net worth. He does run a successful martial arts studio with his brothers, which I actually found out today that Ivanka Trump is also no way, really? uh, goes there. Oh, wow. <laughs> yes. Huh. So they're really like got the you know Miami elite circle covered. Don't mug any of them. <laughs> <laughs> right. Like, totally. Um, yeah. So you know he, he does. He is successful, but obviously Giselle is one of the most famous supermodels in the world, and she's been on the Forbes list forever. And she's worth you know millions and millions and millions of dollars. And she's you know has lucrative contracts with you know, Chanel, H&M, Balenciaga, all of these things over the years. So I do think, you know, why get her pals are thinking that she's going to wait, they're going to live together. Why get into like this messy, why tempt fate was Right, the quote. it's very modern. Um, we're, we're actually, we have, as we speak, there's going to be, I think there's some more stories percolating on page6.com. So you're going to want to stay tuned for that. Keep checking back and also make sure to check out the print newspaper, <laughs> which we also write for.